you about bracing options for the treatment of scoliosis. Many of you that are watching this video have been told that you need to be fitted with a brace for your scoliosis. And I'd like to talk to you about what those options are. Some of you may already even be wearing a brace and not really enjoying it, not being able to do the things that you love. So the typical brace that's recommended are these rigid braces here. And this rigid brace, as you can see, is quite bulky and quite uncomfortable. And so for that reason, compliance is really low. Also, these braces do not allow for you to participate in sports or recreational activities. Um, unfortunately, scoliosis is often detected during a time in a child's life when they're involved in sports like soccer, or cheerleading, dance, and they want to be able to continue those activities. This brace does not allow that. Um, you can see how, how rigid this brace is. It does not allow any movement, and it's quite uncomfortable. It's very bulky. It does not fit easily underneath clothing, and kids don't like the fact that all of their friends can tell that they're wearing it. But there is another solution that we have, um, and we have a flexible brace called the spine core brace. And what you can see here are these bands allow full range of motion. Kids can participate in all sports, all recreational activities. The brace fits close to the body, and it can easily be worn underneath regular clothing. And when it is, it's virtually invisible. So now we take a child that's been told they need to wear a brace, and while that's not the best news that they could possibly hear, they're able to continue the sports and activities that they love. They're able to wear a brace that's going to correct their problem, and no one's going to even know that they've got it on. Another benefit to using the spine core brace for the treatment of scoliosis over the rigid bracing system is that with the dynamic nature of this brace, we're able to create strength and lasting stability in the postural muscles. Rigid bracing systems cause muscle atrophy. Also, scoliosis is a three-dimensional problem, and the spine core brace offers a three-dimensional solution. It's the only brace that reduces the rotation in the spine. The rigid bracing systems are a two-dimensional solution to a three-dimensional problem. Essentially, it's a pressure point system, and it squeezes the spine straight. However, it does not address the rotational component, which is critical in, in creating stability and reduction of these burdens.